For me, pharmacy starts with APHA. It's about opportunity. APHA really allows a unique level of involvement for student pharmacists. When I joined APHA ASP, I learned about the opportunities beyond the counter. So counseling patients on the floor near the OTC aisle, teaching patients about their disease states. And I could do that through APHA ASP's projects and programs by applying the knowledge that I learned in the classroom. There's a lot of opportunities out there to get involved. There's a lot of great professional pharmacy associations out there. But as a student pharmacist, you really want to see it all. And I think APHA ASP provides that opportunity for you. APHA ASP is really unique in that your time commitment is really up to you. It doesn't take a lot of time to make a difference in APHA ASP. APHA gives student pharmacists the ability to be involved in the future of the profession in a unique way. They allow us an unprecedented access to the policy process and to influence through uh, networking with practitioners and each other. As a member, I've had the opportunity to be mentored by older students who encouraged me to become more active in APHA ASB. And I was also had the opportunity to become a mentor to other students. And that networking process has really helped me to grow and it's something that I really enjoy. APHA really brings student pharmacists and pharmacy practitioners together in a way that we can collaborate and work together toward advancing our profession. I can speak to a lot of people who I've networked with and they'll say, hey, if you want, I could take a look at your CV. Or hey, if you want, we could go on dinner, we can talk about like uh, what you should say on interview, what you shouldn't say. I really love the leadership opportunities. There are so many ways for students to get involved at the local level, regional level, and national level. One thing I learned is that you don't have to have a specific position to be considered a leader. When I first started in school, I was just being active in the patient care projects. So a unique program offered by APHA ASP is that of the Utah School on Alcoholism and Other Drug Dependencies. And upon attending, I got to learn about the science side of addiction, but I also learned about the more human side of addiction. And because of that, I know I'm going to be a better pharmacist. My favorite moment as a member was walking into the opening general session at the APHA annual meeting and exposition, seeing all of those student pharmacists that are excited and engaged in their profession and, and moving forward in one direction together towards something that can really affect the, the future of their career. There are plenty of educational opportunities, but we like to get together and have a good time as well. And that comes back to some of the networking that you know, is so important to us as student pharmacists and as practitioners. I think being a member of APHA ASP is an absolute blast. APHA ASP has given me roots so that I can grow as a pharmacist. I think of it as really the lifeblood of our pharmacy profession. There are so many changes going on and APHA is there. APHA has helped me develop my skill sets and it has helped me become a better leader, a better communicator. And continuing to be part of APHA is how I will be able to pay it forward. I maintain my membership in APHA ASP because it doesn't seem to matter how much I put in, I get exponentially more in return. So the mission of APHA ASP is to truly be the collective voice of student pharmacists. We want to provide you with opportunities for you to expand your practice. We want you to improve patient care. We want to be there for you to help develop your career. And we want to help you develop as a leader.